welcome to the third edition of WMS Now. We are here to share information with you about various events, activities, and information going on at Woodbury Middle School. That's right, and remember if you have any interesting ideas or stories, let us know in the counseling office. Brr, it is cold in here. Wow, you're right. I wonder if it'll snow. Yeah, I wonder too. Let's check in with Lauren to figure out the weather for this week. Hi, I'm Lauren and I'm going to give you a winter update and a winter prediction. This week is going to be mostly partly sunny and in the 20s. Now for the winter prediction. The Farmer's Almanac, which has 80% success rate, reports that our winter will be colder than normal. We may get up to 42 to 52 inches of snow. So remember to bundle up. Now back to you guys. Thanks, Lauren. We'll be sure to wear our coats. Hey, Roanne. Yeah, what? What's this little part inside my lip called? Well, Tanner, that's, uh, well, that's, huh, what the heck is that thing called? Great, nobody knows, and I can't even concentrate on my show. If this keeps eating my mind, you, you know what? I'll sleep on it and see if something comes to mind. Whoa, 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 no, Tanner, we're live, you can't take a nap. I bet someone here knows it. Let's go check it out. Well, that's a great question. We were wondering what uh ha ha thing was in my mouth, too. To help answer the question, I brought my friend Ava to help figure it out. Hi, friends. So, Ava, uh ha ha, what is it? The skin between your lip and your gums is called your maxillary labial frenum. By the way, we recommend that you not put your hands in your mouth. Alright, back to you guys. Well, that's interesting. Wonder what Lauren will share with us next time. I've always wondered about why we can't see what's going to happen in the future, but I'm pretty sure we don't have the answer to that yet. Great point, but we do know we have two famous students in our school. That's right, Bonnie and Denzel from the Sea Boys. Let's check out your interview with them. Last year we talked to Bon about Sea Boys. This year we have the pleasure of having two Sea Boys with us, Bon and Dunzel. Thank you for meeting with me today. Thank you for having us. Tell us about your music tour in Africa this summer. Uh, we went for 50 days and we had lots of concerts and we got to see lots of family on the way. Uh, we sang lots of songs and we just had lots of fun. We got to see how our family used to live back then. Lots of ancestry and lots of big stories, and it was really fun. What was your favorite part of the trip? Um, I have to say the zoo was my favorite part because like we had to like see like lots of animals and actually like learn about them. We learned last year that you write your own lyrics. Do you both write them, and what are your inspirations? Uh, me and them, we just uh bring up ideas and then we write it and uh, we just uh, do it together as a family and then we get it like fixed up and like worked up with our producer and lots of our inspirations are like all the things that happen in the world today lots of things that we know that we don't have or like they don't have and we just want to make it better for them do you have a new song that you are going to be releasing soon um no not yeah, I mean, like, we might do one for the summer, but, yeah, I think that will be the only one. What would you like to see happen with the Sea Boys in the future? Uh, I hope we can go far with this, and because uh, we really like singing, and we like doing what we're doing, and we just like making inspiration for lots of kids out there. And I hope that this can continue for a while. Let us take a look at some of your video clips. When we stand together, this bond will last forever. You can bring us down. We were born as brothers, taking care of each other. You can bring us down. I am the brother in the middle, and I keep the peace. My younger and my older brother tend to disagree. Fights, then they reunite, make amends 
also be Brothers to our friends and brothers to the ones in need Stand with each other and be another brother to me To any kid that's an orphan To any kid in a broken home And everyone in pain It's the middle of the winter and Tell me if you feel my pain Tell me if you feel my pain My pain Feel me When your world comes crumbling down And you can't really make a sound And all they do is try to break but you never let them take you Sometimes I wonder If they really feel my pain I want you to be there for me I want you to be there for me Be light up in the dark Be the sun that brights my day If you do this all for me But you never let them take you Sometimes I wonder If they really feel my pain Tell me if you feel my pain Tell me if you feel my pain Tell me if you feel my pain My pain Feel me When your world comes crumbling down And you can't really make a sound And all they do is try to break you But you never let them take you Sometimes I wonder if they really feel my pain We're here again, the Sea Boys! The Sea Boys! We're lucky us Americans have almost Everything we need Mmm, yeah Everyone should know our name Some places have no food for kids So let's make a change around the world Make a change around the world Everyone should know our name Singing to all around the world And all the different races Wow, you guys look great. Well, again, this has been great talking with both of you today. Best of luck in the future. We look forward to hearing your new songs. You're welcome. Bye. Oh, bye. <laughs> what a fantastic opportunity for them. Maybe we could convince them to perform for us here at school sometime. Great idea. Meanwhile, we could attend one of our band or choir concerts. Great idea. Let's check out the schedule. In other announcements, 8th graders, it's almost time to start thinking about high school registration. That's right. On Wednesday, December 14th, the high school counselors from Eastridge and Woodbury will be here to talk to the 8th graders during their science classes about the registration process and what high school life is all about. 
Here are other important dates to remember for registration. There were a few technical difficulties with our last episode. However, here are the clips from all of you sharing what you are thankful for. I'm thankful for food. Having friends and having family to go to. And I am really thankful that I have food because not that many people around the world have thankful it. thankful for living. And my favorite tradition for Thanksgiving is probably soup. I am thankful for um, my parents and I'm thankful that I have a house to live in. I'm thankful that I have such great teachers and friends and a great school. My favorite Thanksgiving Day tradition is spending time with family. I'm thankful for the military, Air Force, and the Army. I am thankful for my family and my school. And my favorite Thanksgiving tradition is to cook the meal with my mom. I am thankful for my family, my friends, and uh, the people around me. And my favorite tradition is um, cutting open the turkey. I am thankful for my family and my uh, cousins and getting food on the table. I'm thankful for my family and my friends. And I'm thankful for my family and everything. I um, I'm thankful for like sports and sports. My name is Francesca and I'm thankful for being with my family and for all my friends. My tradition is going to Nebraska with my family. My favorite Thanksgiving tradition is going bowling with my family in the morning of Thanksgiving. I am thankful for life and my parents, my sister, my dogs. And I'm thankful for hockey and I'm thankful for hunting. I'm thankful for my oranges. Hey! Thankful for hot cheese. I'm thankful for friends, family, and Justin Bieber. We're thankful for Christmas. Um, I'm thankful for 21 Savage. He's my husband, and I love him to die. Um, I'm thankful for Snickers ice cream and all the other food out there. Thank you for blessing us with your deliciousness. For the food on Thanksgiving. I'm thankful for more milk and tacos, tamales, enchiladas, beans, tortillas. You know, quesadillas. I'm thankful and for living. Thankful for this awesome school I go to. Four pair of prescription glasses and a retainer, plus numerous other items. Make sure you take a look if you are missing something from this school year. This week we'll be checking in with all of you again to share what your favorite tradition or activity is during winter break. Start thinking about what you'd like to say and we'll record you during lunchtime. Okay, that's it for this episode. Bye! <laughs> hey, avocado! Oh my god! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say that I'm gonna count